Running water usually produces an atmosphere of peace and quiet, but not so in this case. For here at Loch Sloy, we see the north of Scotland's hydroelectric scheme promoted by the board, whose responsibility it is to supply three quarters of Scotland with electricity. The dam, which is being built at the eastern end of the loch, has massive buttresses, 160 feet high and 1160 feet long. This valley will eventually be flooded and serve as a reservoir and it's hoped to provide storage equivalent to 20 million units. The generating station which houses the turbines is situated on the shores of Loch Lomond. Water will travel by means of aqueducts and tunnels, branching off eventually into four seven-foot pipelines which run downhill to the turbines. Inside the generating station, we see the vertical turbo alternators well on their way to completion. Incidentally, this isn't the only power scheme under construction, for the Tunnel Gary project is in full swing at Pitlochry, and the board development programme hopes to produce some six million units of electricity annually. By the way, with all this great planning and advancement, don't think the salmon have been forgotten. Passes have been built to enable them to reach the spawning grounds during the season. <laughs> 